Well, a couple days ago, my cousin Jake mentioned a show called Ben 10, and my brain was all like, And then it turns out that Jake was watching that horrible reboot of Ben 10 that needs to die in hell. Ha 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 It's funny watching it die, that horrible reboot. <laughs> Anyway, if you were a kid growing up in the eh generation, you probably know what I'm talking about. And yes, shut up, I'm calling it the eh generation. I'm terrible at names, so leave me alone. Anyway, let's get going on with the backstory of what this show is. Anyway, Ben 10 follows a young 10 year old boy named Ben Tennyson who discovers a watch uh, that contains many different alien DNA. Like, different alien species, the DNA of the species, and by, and then by tapping this watch, he can access the alien species, which he uses to go on many adventures and fight many crimes. So, this is one good thing that this show does. It's the fact that our main character, Ben 10, he actually acts like a 10-year-old, unlike most cartoon characters that are, that are kids. Most kid cartoon characters act like young adults not actual kids. For an example, one time Ben used one of his aliens to get out of a water park round because he was sick of waiting. You see, that seems like something a 10 year old would do, which is what most shows struggle at. And that's my favorite part about the show, is the fact that he actually acts like a real kid. Oh, and this show's theme song, it is like the DuckTales theme song of our generation. <laughs> Fortunately, this theme song does have a side effect. It created stuck in your head itis. We go live to a victim right now. Where are the rules for the list? The coolest design and special feats. That's how we will be ranking these aliens in this top 10 video. Number 10 is Ripjaws, an alien modeled after an angular fish, which is a pretty cool fish. Instead of, you know, the obvious choice of a shark, they picked a more lesser known fish. But the reason why it's at number 10 is because he's only able to be used in water, so that kind of limits his possibilities and feats. My number 9 pick, I pick Blocks. Blocks is an odd choice, I know, but he has the cool ability of, like, creating things because he's, like, a Lego alien, and if the Kool-Aid man bursts through his wall, he can just make a new one. Sorry about that weird edit there, but something happened. Anyway, my number eight pick is Walmart. I like Walmart because he has, like, predator vision, and he also has, like, bloodhound. It's like the predator and a bloodhound fused together, and that's just awesome. Number seven now. Now on this one, I'm probably going to get a lot of hate, but I'm putting way big at number 7. It's just because I don't find his design too interesting. I prefer Humongousaur, which is more like Kaiju Godzilla style. But I still put him on the list because he's big and giant and does have cool moments. So, yep, that was number 7. Now my number 6 pick, I have a lot to say about. It's Upgrade. Upgrade is an alien goo that can upgrade your technology into various form. It's like, say your phone is dying, you can use this alien to jump inside your phone and then recharge it to full, then recharge it back to full battery. That's how awesome this alien is. So that's why Upgrade is number six, and since I'm such a technology now, th that's part of the reason Upgrade is on the list. Number five, Heat Blast. I just like his design, his powers, and his voice. Have a listen. Perfect. Took him long enough. Accelerate is a lizard like Sonic the Hedgehog with skates for feet. I, I love his voice, his design, his ability, and his like little wheels. It actually explains why he's fast because he has like the skates on his feet. Unlike most other fast characters, you can actually see why he's fast. And uh, yep, that's my opinion on Accelerate. Number three, Ghost Freak. He's one of the only aliens that escaped the Omnitrix. His transformation is cool, and his powers are unique, and his voice is cool as well. Number two is forearms. Do I even need to say anything? Number one, Diamond Head. He's another buff alien, but I like him. He, he has unique abilities. I love his design and transformation. His voice is cool, and he's just all around the best alien. 
and that was my top 10 list.